Wave Web. Welcome back to the Hanging with Web Show. I'm GW Pometer. We are in Orlando, Florida right now. We are at the International Christian Film and Music Festival on World Famous International Drive. We are hanging out right now with filmmakers Jose Res Ret Restrepo. <laughs> That's good. No. What he said. Yeah. <laughs> you try it. Mm -hmm. And Rusty Proctor. Right. A little easier, right? Thank you, guys. Yeah. Thanks for coming of course, of course. Thank you. Guys, we thank really you. appreciate it. No, thank it. you. All right. So, um, what can we tell you? That's it. We're done. <laughs> we introduced ourselves. We're that's good. That's it. Is that all you need? It? You need more? <laughs> of course you do. You're the internet. <laughs> um, okay. So, we have Faith, faith Ties yeah. the Alley. Yeah. Yes. Okay. That's all we know. That's all you know? That's all we know. Um, can you tell us more? Yeah, we can tell you more. <laughs> I want to hear more. Sure. Tell me more. Uh, so, Rusty Proctor is the originator and creator and writer of the project property that started out actually as a play. And it was based on his experience and personal stories. All right. And I came to the project uh, originally as an editor. Okay. And uh, we started collaborating and seeing what was there and what was calling us to be there. And I took the footage and I said, you know what? I think what we need to do is slow down. And I think what we have here is a short film, a really good short film, right. and the beginnings of an idea of a story that could really be powerful and impactful. So we cut that, and we put that together, and uh, he had a pretty good reaction to it. And we decided I, to... <laughs> well, I mean, yeah. he had never seen the footage put together. It was living in the can for... For months, months, for yeah. months, months yeah. yeah. After we had, sh after they had shot it, because I just okay. again, I just approached you it as, came the out as the editor. Originally, yeah. yeah, yeah. And uh, so now the next step in the process is, like I said, is we we brought it to the festival circuit. Um, this is our second festival that we've attended and this it's year. Here in its short form. It is correct, okay. and it's a proof of concept. Proof of concept. Okay. Yeah. So, what's your goal with this? Is it to see a feature? Is it to see a uh, feature? Absolutely. To see a feature. Okay. Now, you, this came from a stage play. Right. right. And you're a playwright. Right, absolutely. Okay. So uh, I, we did the play in 2008, and uh, we had really great response from it. Okay. And um, so my uh, my writing partner, who he is more adept at screenwriting, okay, um, he turned it into a screenplay um, within uh, a month after we had finished the play. That's a gift. It took me two years to take a script and turn it into a novel. Right. <laughs> right. Yeah. No, he's he's very prolific, and so uh, and from there we've been uh, we've been refining and refining and refining, and uh, we're at the point now where um, we're looking to to have the feature done. And so Jose and I, what we're working on is we're really in development with the script, making sure that we have it, you know, as lean and tight as we can get it, and uh, and we're gonna get. Um, you know, a solid budget together. Has the to short particular. shown yet? It did. It, it showed, did. Yeah. showed today. Yeah. 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 And it was good I, response. What, what was the audience? Good response. I yeah. thought it was. What, well, I felt like it was actually a really strong response yeah. for what I was looking for. Like, I, I think the festival format here is also challenging in the sense that they have many things screening at the same time. A lot of stuff. Right. Yes. And which is <laughs> there's a lot happening all over this building. And yes. it's fantastic. Yeah. And also because it's such a specific uh, audience, uh -huh. you know, it's also fascinating for me because like I said I'm I'm a, I'm a new filmmaker um, I've, I've got a I had a career as an actor and I've come to festivals before as an actor but never as a filmmaker so this time I'm really trying to immerse myself in it uh -huh. um, and finding a festival that's aligned with the context of this short film particularly and what we hope the feature will be uh -huh. uh, has been a, a, just a fantastic learning experience because we've been able to see so many other great films, short yes, films yes, here, yes. that have both of us just knocked us out. Right. We, we, we always tell our, our artists, especially uh, breaking into whatever it is they're doing, yeah. if you're, you're going to be a writer, be a reader. Right. Read a, yeah. lot, a lot of stuff. Read a yes. lot of stuff because yes. you become a better writer by emulating those writers that you admire and that yeah. you read. If you're going to be a filmmaker, right. Watch movies. Right. Lots right. and lots of movies. See what has worked. See what didn't work. Ask yourself when you walk out if you don't feel fulfilled. Yeah. Why yep. not? Yes. What was right. it missing? Right. Because a lot of right. times it's not the story. Right. 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 A lot right. of times right. it's that one missing element. Right. One beat too soon right. or well, too yeah, late. Absolutely. Yeah. And you know, sometimes it can be something that uh, is is uh, like if the sound is off, 
I, there have been king so many. Dad. <laughs> there have been, you hear that, Internet? Sound is king. Sound, sound is, is king. oh my sound goodness, is, yes. Because it'll take you, you out of it. Right now, yeah. not nah, because right. successful. <laughs> because that. Four yeah. years I've been doing this show. Yeah. And we started out like any other YouTube channel out there. I pulled my phone out of my pocket right, and right. said, let's talk. Right. Yeah. And, and I had done, I'd been a newspaper reporter and hundreds of interviews before okay. that. But let's talk to my phone. I got home and went, I couldn't hear anything. Right. right. And, and it makes it, a difference. Having good sound is so, so critical. Yes. When you're on set. And it's and the actors are bringing the performances, yep. right. and you can see your script come alive, yeah. Yeah. and it's wonderful. And yeah. you get to the editing room, and you're yeah. like, "Yeah, I'll call them back." Right. right. Exactly. Yeah. No, we got to do the whole. Yeah. Do you yeah. have the budget for ADR? Because yeah. guess what? Right. We don't got it. Well, and, I, and I also like when we were speaking earlier off camera, like the fact that like you want to also at least I'm, like I said, I have I have experience as a performer. So when I direct, I'm a method director. I get intimate with the script. I get intimate with the production values of the Wait, script. Did you say, did you, did you, he invented that word. <laughs> what? Make him famous. What? He's a method no. director. No, please. That term's been coined before. No, but for real. I, I, there, and I think there's many people here that would consider themselves the same thing. I'm, uh, I'm not going to be in a... I'm going to... Let me rephrase that. I'm going to try my best to keep leading my actors to the moment. You know, so they can be in the moment and the rest of the crew there can support and capture the moment. You know, that's our job as filmmakers. And what I've seen here has been um, this balancing act, right, between story and message and message and story and, and the constant push and pull. And when, you can, when you can deliver some of the films that are here and manage to bring both together. Right. Yeah. It really is an accomplishment. Yes. Because when you yeah. set out as a storyteller, yes. oftentimes that balancing act, one, one always wins over the other. So a lot of times, here's my message, yeah. and I got my message out. Yeah. But people were kind of like, I don't know if I like those characters. I don't, I don't know if I like that story, that right. environment. Right. Or I got my story told. It was a pure, brilliant story. And they walk out of there and they think, oh, that was about this. And you're like, no, it wasn't. Wow. It's, you know, it's yeah. interpretation yeah. is everything. Right. Yeah. So when you're able to bring both of those two together. together, it's, yeah. it's magic. It's yeah. really, that is the definition of movie magic. Yes. To be able to deliver a human message while telling a good story. Right. right. And Could, we were sitting out on the campfire, that's what we do. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. We love to tell stories. Right. That's exactly it. And I think so. well, that's mm -hmm. we started as actors together right. way back in the day. Yeah. And uh, when this circle kind of right, came full I around. Like we got a lot more day than you. So. <laughs> no, not by much, brother. Not by much. You're just a way good actor. No, no, no. Just, just saying. Look at him. Over no, yeah, no, no. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but he had to grow his beard out four inches just so he could tell the gray. Just right, 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 gray. Right, right, right. Yeah. Absolutely. Um, it took me $4 to get rid of the gray. <laughs> Please. No, but we, I don't even try anymore. Right. <laughs> right. I'm, I'm done. But, I, but to your point, as far as like you starting um, on a, with the, and the small digital, you know, and mm -hmm. just trying to do it like that, I have also like, I've seen a variety of levels of here, you know, some that right away the film critic in me wants to be like, okay, well, here's my critique. Bang, 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 bang. Versus the artist in me wants to be like, hold on. Who did this? Yeah. How old were they? How much experience did they have? What were they trying to say? Mm -hmm. And I've had conversations here with filmmakers of, of different places and stuff. And I'm like, I'm just inspired because it's like, ah, we are all here trying to do the best we can uh, with what we got. When you when you talk to some of the young filmmakers here and they and they, and they you know whip out their phone and they, yeah, I just shot my 4K movie. And know, right? Like, and you're like. What? what? <laughs> on your well, phone? On your phone? <laughs> how are you going to edit that? <laughs> yeah, yeah. First of all, how are you getting it off your yeah, phone? Yeah, how are you going to get it off your phone? Because, you know, there's, a, there's yeah, yeah, yeah. some space issues. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right yeah. Uh, it's, it's incredible to see what can be done right yeah. now. Yeah. And, and the tools are there. Right. And the technology is there. Yeah. And, and it's nurturing that talent, though. Yeah. And bringing it up so that the tools and the technology and the talent come together. Oh, we got to put you on a bullhorn, man, because that's, that's the truth. And like put it all together. Yeah going to be a good storyteller and I mean yeah guys um what's it like for you seeing your 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 you saw it on stage you're you're a stage writer right so now you sit there and you're in the audience and there is your story up on the screen I'm going to tell you the truth this is this might be a little bit embarrassing but I'm going to tell you the truth when I he took the footage he went away he did his thing he brought me over to show it to me, and it had music, and we had done the color correction, and we had like all, and I sat down to watch it, 
and I cried. <laughs> and it was like, Jose, I I'm sorry, man. I just, I mean, it was very emotional when I saw it. And uh, it, it was powerful to see. What's it like to see audiences see it? Oh, I, at the end of see, it. See, because that's I one was, of those, those, those that's, a dumb, yeah. that's a catch-22, right? When you saw it, you cried, it, this is my vision, and there it is. Yes. But now... Out. You it's see free. Them, see you, see you. Right. Right. Yes. I don't even know how to do that. No, 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 Yeah, I mean, that's, that's, that's an amazing moment. Yeah, that's well, you know, that. seeing seeing people uh, and seeing their reaction today uh -huh. was, it was thrilling, and I was uh, I was pretty uh, overwhelmed by it. I, you know, and people would, you know, come up and want to talk to me about it, yeah. and, and I'm trying to stay present, stay in the moment, because I'm you inside, I'm like, together. You came up acting together. Yeah. Yeah. Stage acting? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, we we worked in Southern California together, and then we kind of like veered off to do our own careers. But yeah, and now yeah. we just happen to be um, reconnected by the same organization again. Awesome. Um, yeah, it's it's bananas again. And I also feel like each of us having had that individual experience, right? I went to I went to New York for 15 years. I had I had somewhat of a career on Broadway. Did had had fell in love with the community more than Absolutely. anything else, right? If you're an artist, yeah, it once. Once you find your tribe, yeah, that's never it. leave right. again because yeah. this is where you're home, right? Right. So. And, and I think the thing is, is you know, what I've learned is that your tribe changes yeah. and your home really comes from that sense of you. <laughs> and if you're finding that from someone or something else, well, change is going to happen. Mm -hmm. And then it becomes a real question of faith, mm -hmm. right? Um, so my point is, I don't find it to be a coincidence that I went on to do the things that I said I was, I want to be on Broadway, that was my drive. Mm -hmm. He went on to do what he wanted to do. I'm going to be a successful businessman, I'm going to write. And then when we both kind of like, were like, huh, we need this to go out in a different way that we don't know where. We both have been, and I'm learning this phrase this week more and more, we're both stepping out in faith to believe, not only in the project, but in ourselves that we can do this, that we can really do this. We have the experience, like literally, like I said, I've got experience, man. I can't yeah, shy away from yeah, that anymore. No. He's got experience, you can't shy yeah. away from that anymore. When you start the journey, yeah. you never know which way you're going. Right. right. Pieces that, the pieces that are gonna fit together the best will find their way back together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's yeah. literally it, it what we're finding. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, it, and it takes a lot of those experiences, as you were saying. Yeah. She's gonna wave that damn card at me and I'm gonna go ahead and say goodbye. Yes. So we're gonna say Time. thank you to our partners and our friends over at Famous Faces and Funny Space Coast Comics and the Originals, our great friend Josh Bauer at J. Bauer Arts, Celestial Healings, Krypton Radio, the Foxwood Wine Company, and our dear friend, author Yvonne Mason with Off the Chain Radio. We have been here hanging with Jose Restrepo hey. and Rusty Proctor, hey. the filmmakers behind Faith Ties, The Alley, a film coming to your local Cineplex very, very soon. You're as famous. As soon as they get it made, okay? <laughs> Which they'll be doing right after all of these people decide they love the short so oh, much they man. have to see it in feature length form. Thank when you. that happens, look for these guys. Until then, go on IMDb, IMDb these guys, because they just got an IMDb credit right here on the show. Uh, so, right. you guys, stay tuned in, stay logged on, and see who we're hanging with next. Thank you guys. Oh, you guys, thank you, you guys. so much. That was a lot of fun.